All right, I just want to welcome you all back to Ghosts of Tsushima. We are continuing on from last episode where we learned how to do archery. And right now, I'm currently just following this golden bird right here. It does seem somebody's at the top of there. I don't know if... I'm guessing they're friendly. But, like I said, I uh, appreciate you all watching this series, commenting, you know, liking, just sitting back, relaxing, and making it part of your day. It really do really do appreciate it look at this dude it looks so nice looks so nice let's go and see what this person has to say up here Good day, my lord. oh hi friendly good evening My brother wanted to be a samurai, Lord Sakai. He built a bamboo training stand, spent a whole winter practicing on it. Bamboo cutting. An excellent way to become a better swordsman. Perhaps I can join your brother in practice. Sadly, he died of fever a few years ago. But every time I see a stand beneath its flag, I think of him. And now so will I. Thank you. Take care. Oh, damn. Well, we've done some um, bamboo. I think we actually did that last episode, right? Because uh, obviously I'm recording this on another day now, so I need to quickly remember what happened yesterday and the, the first couple of episodes of the series. Got some supplies and everything, but we are going to be heading to the second part of this tale, which is um, Sensei Ishikawa, and I learned that his former student, Tomeo, uh, has sided with the Mongols. He asked me to meet him at his dojo so we can continue the hunt to track her down. So we are going to do this, and it, it is a minor range charm we can get and some silk. And I thought we might as well do that since it's pretty, you know, in close proximity and we can check out this village as well. And then we're going to head down south. Maybe I'll check out this little landmark here as well. Uh, see what's there. See if we can uh, find anything that's possibly discoverable. So let's mount Shadow again and uh, head in the direction of where the wind is going to take us. So we're only about 240 meters away. Which is right in front of us, in fact. But I've uh, I've seen that a lot of you guys are playing this. You're enjoying it. Some of you have already played it. Uh, and are... Well, I've played it since the PS4, PS5 version. Uh, and more than likely by now, if you're watching this, I'm probably about six hours ahead of this video um, of like footage. So I'm probably many hours ahead of what when this video gets released because I think this video will get released on the 21st. Um, and that is also when Hellblade 2 comes out. So I'll be recording that, but I won't be releasing that until after we either finish this or... The, uh, what's it called? I forgot the game. Plinktail Requiem. That one. Sakai. Hello, friend. Sensei, any word on Tomoe? Yes, but I'm not sure you are ready for her. You make her sound like a demon. That's not far off the mark. Tomoe is fearless. She is not samurai, but she is a born killer. I know the type. No, you do not. The sensei and the student. Come. Where are we headed? An archery range. The locals are Mongols training there. I suspect Tomoe was with them. If Tomoe is truly fearless, she'd make a useful ally. A starving leopard is fearless too. Leopards can't master your way of the bow. Let it go, Sakai. She will never join us. Why does she turn against you? I took a risk sharing all I knew with her. When she betrayed my trust, I punished her. It must have been harsh. You saw what she did to the prisoners at Fort Nakayama. 
That was no mistake. That was a choice. And not the first time she's made it. It could also be survival law. A fault. You don't. I do. I guess it all depends on what she's like when we visit her, when we when we come face to face with her. So at the end of the day, like I said, it could be survival. She could easily be deceiving the Mongols right now of, of um, you know, just keeping her alive. Uh, sometimes you've got to do wicked things to survive for you or your loved ones. Uh, and if that's what she uh, is doing. You have to climb to get there. Sure okay. you can make it, Sensei. So, whoop. What are you waiting for, Sakai? You need a hand, Sensei? It'd be so funny if he's already at the top. Oh, he actually is. Not bad, Sakai. You said the only way up was to climb. No. I said you had to climb. It's good exercise. Arrows. Mongo and Japanese. If they were here, they're long gone. We might pick up their trail by the practice target. There is no target. Near that watchtower. Not bad, Sensei. Find out where they went. Wait, that's the tower we were just at a minute ago and we're speaking to her, that woman about her brother. Move it, Sakai. Give me a second, let me grab some arrows. Inspect the target. Okay, let's go. I'm super interested in seeing what other items we're going to gather. Um, like a new weapons and abilities and how are you going to become a ghost? And obviously there's rumors and speculations about Ghost of Tsushima 2 right now, so... I'm super stoked to get in this journey underway. How many Mongols is Tomoe training? Oh my god. A severed head. Used for target practice. Sensei! Mongols here! Jesus! I'm not gonna lie, I totally forgot how to dodge then. How do I dodge? Alright, okay, got it. I totally forgot how it's, it's been 24 hours. Good work, Sakai. We was literally just here a minute ago. Resting your bow arm, Sensei. Observing your response to an ambush. You knew those Mongols were still here. Yes. You didn't think to mention it? If you can't handle a few Mongols, what good will you be against Tomoe? This is war, not a test. And how many wars have you fought? I'll test you as I see fit. I can see why Tomoe attacked you. <laughs> now, where did she go, Sakai? I'll look around. A lot of tracks. A dozen men. Maybe more. Follow the trail. Tomoe. Okay, let's have another check in here since see where the Mongols come from. And I didn't even realize there was heads there when we come here last time. Unless there wasn't. Double check up here. Yeah, nothing. Oh, he's going up here as well. Back down we go. Let's follow these tracks down. Probably lead us to a fort or something. If we catch her, do not wait for me. Attack and keep moving, or you'll die. Do you plan to use your bow this time? If we find her, 
And if not... Can you take a dozen enemy soldiers without me? If I must. Good answer. Oh. A little compound here. There's a fort up on that mountain up there. I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like my... My camera is a little low right now. What is this? There's somebody on the edge over there with a ball. down below us got a beehive over there we have a prisoner on the edge prisoner at the door supplies on that barrel i don't see anybody else down this side he's armored so obviously we can't hit him with the arrows but what i could do is distract him like that right now with the bees Mess that up. Is he coming towards us? He doesn't know we're here, to be honest. Messed up so bad there. I don't know why I pressed um, X for to dodge there for some reason. When I know full well it's circle. Oh. Okay. So we've unlocked the water stance. Is it highly effective against shields? Effective against shield men. Heavy attacks deal extra sta uh, stagger damage. Triangle, 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 the shield breaker, hold triangle, then tap triangle, triangle for flurry strike, and hold right uh, R2 to change stances. Okay. Ah, okay, so we go into stone stance, which is good against just melee. Then we can switch to water stance, which actually changes my stance and go up against um, shielding. So I want to be fluid with this in combat and switch to for better targets. West you're in hostages. The Mongols have taken hostages. If the enemy spots you, they will start executing their prisoners. Which, technically, Please we didn't get spotted. Me. Did you see a Japanese woman with these Mongols? I couldn't believe it. She was giving them orders. What did she say? Something about the sensei and the hot springs. That's all I heard, my lord. Forgive me. Okay. Hot springs. We'll speak to him. Then we'll have a look, look around. I taught a monster how to hunt. They heard Tomoe giving orders to the Mongols. She mentioned Hiyoshi Springs. She's just getting started. Sakai, the way you fight. It's not your uncle's way, and it's not mine. We've never faced an enemy like this. I do what I must to defeat them. A samurai is a guardian. Not a killer who darts around like a thief. You didn't see Komodo. I've seen enough. 
I know it was brutal, but I won't train another monster. I know. I won't let that happen. If Tomoe is going after Yoshi Springs, I need to prepare. So do you. I'll see you at my dojo, Sakai. Okay. So back to the uh, dojo. So that is tail number two complete. Increase our uh, technique points here, which we could spend, which we will do momentarily. And we're going to have a quick look around here as well. So we've just got the charm of efficiency for completing that. Uh, range charm, we'll take a look at it. Uh, and the journal has now been updated also. So Sensei Ishikawa, traitorous former student Tomeo, Tomei, I, I keep pronouncing her name wrong, uh, is training a Mongol archers in Hayoshi. We stopped some uh, from brutalizing a small settlement, but to Tohomo uh, is still out there. I will meet Ishikawa at his dojo to plan our next move. Okay. So we can go back to go back to the dojo to see what's going on. Um, obviously, the gold missions do seem to be a progression in story. Um, and all that kind of good stuff. So recruit Lady uh, Mikao, the Straw Hats, and Unit Blacksmith's brother. Seems to be part of Act 1. So I don't want to, because I have a feeling that we'll get to a certain point within the acts that it will say, okay, if you go past this point, you can't go back to these missions. And as you know, I do like to cover all the inches of the game. So we will be doing side quests and all that kind of stuff. Just like, a, you know, I'll talk about in the description. Um, oh, complete activities to study your mind and hence your abilities and help bring peace to the island. Where is my techniques? So we have samurai. So we do have one point available. Um, an evasive strike useful against slow moving enemies. That could be kind of useful for the brutes, which is kind of one of our harder oppositions right now. Perfect healing parry. Perfect parries recover a small amount of health, which is not a bad shout because I do parry a lot. Parry incoming projectiles while blocking. Oh, that might be useful. An evasive strike is looking slow. Maybe target, sprint towards your enemy and slash them. I think I'm going to go with the deflect arrows. We could have gone through some exploration there, but not just yet. Um, I don't think we got anything regarding gear. We did get a charm, however. Um, so, weapons and ammo. Yeah, we got seven out of eight arrows. We got quick fire, which we did just check the uh, shurikens a minute ago. 15% increase to knocking and reloading speeds. Okay. We might as well equip it. We've got three charms available since we found that fox. Um, I'm pretty sure it was the fox, right? The bamboo was something else. Okay. Tales of Tsushima are now available. Help people across the island and build your legend. So Tales is obviously this guy who we're working on. Like I said, silver is kind of your side quests. Gold are your main quests. Um, and obviously we'll get more rewards from the gold quest, but also, you know, progress the story super quick. But I do want to do side quests as well. So I do think we kind of move on with uh, the Ishikawa's tale to find out about this archer and to, to Hermit, to, to him, Tomeo, Tomeo, that rings a bell. <laughs> Some of you guys are probably shouting at the TV now. Or your monitor is going like, stop saying it wrong. <laughs> but anyway, let's have a look around here. Let's see if there's any supplies we can actually grab and scrounge up before. I didn't want to... Oh, what a spoon. Wanted to grab that. There we go. Grab as many supplies as we can. Because we've not got to the point yet where we can spend them. Uh, we do need a blacksmith for that. Uh, and that's where Yuno comes into it. Later on, when we speak to her brother... seen anything up here maybe in this would he grab some supplies from here maybe there wasn't much here to be honest i do want to see, like be careful and like look around in case there is any you know little hidden items and let's check this little building down here um any like hidden little gems or all that kind of stuff we can kind of find some little easter eggs or you know 
collectibles. We might as well top up on our arrows. We are fully stocked now. Uh, we, I could do with just giving myself a cheeky heal. And I'm not seeing any POIs at the minute. There's also these sticks I've been collecting, but I don't know what I need them for. There's an encampment down there. I didn't want to do that. Let's pull up that. And where is he now? Oh, he's back at his dojo. Let's mark him down. Undiscovered location. I'm going to keep on doing the trials around here. Um, the till, sorry. Just because... Um, I expect he might take us to some locations. Wait, what is this? Why can I... That's weird. Oh, it drops us down there. But there is a log there that's... Strangely placed. Do we get a some form of grapple? Or something? That we can get up places quicker. That could be useful. Alright, let's ride. Head back to Ishikawa. Somebody may be trying to find my way down here. Let's try and find a road or a path or something. Here we go. This road. Oh my god, bodies. Somebody just slaughtered these. Just be careful I don't get ambushed. Here. He's up the mountain, right? He's up the mountain. I'm heading down it. Here we go. Finally made it, climbing the side of the mountain. That guy. Hello. Any news of Tomoe? Travelers have been shot dead on the roads in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. People are afraid to leave or deliver supplies. You think that's our doing? A few archers, a strategic points. Can isolate a whole town. A tactic of yours when you were Clan Nagao's archery master. Tomoe was a good student. Too good. We're fighting your own reflection. We will turn that to our advantage. The past never passes. How do you propose we find these archers? We think like Tomoe. We want to control movement in and out of Hiyoshi Springs. Where do we put archers? A handful of men could shut down the road to the coast. Yes. That path behind the inn. No. Poor cover, no clear lines of sight. You want to cover the largest territory with the fewest archers. I would want someone looking over the bridge into town. So would I. It would be smart to control the main entrance into town. Mm, people already avoid the main road. 
Archers there would be wasted. The road south runs along a high ridge. Perfect place to rain down arrows. Tomoe would agree. There's hope for you. Let's go hunting. Okay. Reach the coastal road. I'm just curious now, if I call my horse, what will, else he, did you teach will he get Tomoe? a horse? I held back nothing. Including why you left Clan Nago? That's no secret. It's time to retire. Oh, he will. Beautiful. But you continued to teach. Not at first. What changed your mind? The bow is my life. Putting it down felt like death. So I chose to live. But do you regret giving up a warrior's life? Mastery of the bow is mastery of oneself. That is the only victory worthy of a samurai. The rest is noise. Okay. Straight ahead. We'll try and take the bamboo forest. Unless we get eaten by bears or something. I do like how I got on a horse then and so did he. So we don't just have to run everywhere. We're getting close. Eyes open. This light is beautiful. What's this on the road here? Travelers. Murdered. Let's help their killers follow them across the Sansu River. <laughs> Bungles. Multiple. could stand off, but I do want to try just to work on a few little stealth tricks, I guess. Okay, we've got a shield guy, a lot of archers. Keep an eye on the trees. Take him down in the bush. Two guys here. These seem really close. Then we just got these arches on this ridge here, it seems like. Why did he get his sword and shield out then? Negium Harsinta, you went and you Yeah, I was just about to switch. I, w I wanted to use my kunai's again, but I forgot how to do it. I forgot how to change to it. Okay, a little messy. Why I wasn't here? Keep moving. The good thing is, is what I, what I do like about games like this is we grow with the character. So me as a player will only get more experienced the more we play, and the more he adventures, the more he learns the way of the ghosts and all that kind of stuff. So it's kind of like a journey of self progression as well. Like we messed up a lot of times though. Come to end game, that won't be the case. We will become a lethal force. Right, so I think the next lookout was the tower, correct? All those innocent dead. Tomoe has thrown everything away. Betrayed her people. 
She is a traitor because the Mongols offer power and wealth, status. It was denied her by birth. Tomoe knew she was born to a lower station than she deserved. Now you're being too kind. I understand how they think. But people who sow chaos must be punished. Your way sows chaos. In the enemy. Not just them. The samurai must use violence with their strength. Without it, you unleash endless bloodshed. The point is to defeat your enemy. That's how you end bloodshed. Tomoe told me the same thing. Alright, let's leave the horses here. The watchtower is just up ahead. I don't see anybody in it. Ambush! Nice shot. There's an artifact nearby and my controller is pulsing. One more snake nest to find. Come. Okay, so the ambush. Oh, there's a firefly. Where's he going? Okay, I think it's up above, but the firefly doesn't seem to be flying that way. There is an artifact. Records. Sensei Ishikawa, Lord Hir Hirotsune uh, Nagao, urgently requests your presence in Komodo. I am instructed to give you my horse and all the supplies you require to make the journey immediately in the defense of our lands. Please lay aside, uh, lay aside any concern for past mis misunderstandings. As his lordship assures you, the archers of Clan Nagao uh, recall their greatest exemplar in the utmost fondness, respect, and devotion. Yusumasi Sa uh, Sas Sasikai. Captain of the Right Guard of Lord uh, Hirotsune Nagao. I'm so sorry if I'm butchering these names. I will learn. What's that down there? Wait a minute. If I'm up here, can I see POIs? I don't think so, but what's that down there? The question is, is though, why did he engage? He, he attacked the marchers. Is that a roaming traveller? Roaming merchant? How did Tomoe become your student? She showed up at my dojo with her father's makeshift hunting bow and refused to leave. You didn't turn her away? I tried, but she sank arrow after arrow into my target. Some recent acquisitions I've never here. never seen talent like hers. She must have had training. Form was wrong. Bore vanity useless in a real fight. But she oh, had no oh. fear of missing a shot. She never hesitated. A warrior's spirit. No. A killer's. I didn't see until it was too it's late. Sure. If you can bring more, it's yours. Okay. I don't know what I just bought there. Did I? Did I buy a new bow? Oh, well. Is that what I was bought? Weapon, ranged half bow. Oh, okay, I got the, uh, I got a skin. Basically. Visit any boy you to upgrade, okay. I basically just purchased a skin for it, okay, good to know. So you do kind of keep the weapons and everything. Like I said, uh, I think it was in the first episode, like, it wouldn't make sense for him to not use his father's sword. 
but using um, different skins is obviously a, an option. I'll keep going into this mode. What, what's we got near us? Okay, we need to travel through this town. What's this over here? Is this a boy? Yeah. There's another firefly. Is it in here? It is. Four out of 40 collected. Music stories to remember. I not learn the good writing, but some was writing down songs of the Biwa Hoshi. Hoshi. Very good stories. But he killed by invaders, then no more stories. Forget it by all. Long ago, there was a boar using man. He saved the town. Also another boar using man who killed the demons. And the man who is very fast with katana swings. So many others write, to, write more tomorrow. Now go deliver supplies to Jade Hill's camp. Yeah, he's definitely learning English. Just like I'm trying to learn how to learn Japanese names. Okay, let's go and see who this guy is. And yeah, I have a, do have a feeling this could be a boy. Yeah. Okay, this is a gold icon. So I, this, I, hopefully it's not a mission. Where's the entrance to this? Inside here. Oh, well, hello there. It is a boy. Yeah. I can make sure your bow is in the best possible condition. Whatever you can do, I'd appreciate it. The honor is mine. Just bring me the raw materials I need and leave the rest to me. Okay, so obviously bringing like the iron and all this stuff we've been finding. So we can upgrow, upgrade. Wow, that's a lot of differences to be honest. So the request in 25 bamboo, which we have exact amount, and they want 150 supplies and we have 290, and that increases. That's a big, big difference there. There's no visual change, it seems, on the bow, unless it doesn't affect anything that's had a skin on it. Death. From afar. But we might as well upgrade it whilst we are currently doing like the stuff with Ishikawa. Thank you. Nice. Okay. I do want to quickly check if we go to gear now and check the weapons and ammo with the bow. If I was to turn this off, has this changed? It has not. So the appearance doesn't change like any form of different strings or any different stuff that ha adds to the bow. Uh, reached the south end, so we need to kind of keep pushing through this village. We'll come up on this side. Actually, it's going to be up the cliff, isn't it? There is a climbing point here, though. But I'm glad we found that little town, to be honest. Hello? Why can I not grab this one? Oh, there we go. What is this? I can't go that way, but I can go this way. There's a piece of equipment I feel like we can grab to grab all of them tree, them tree trunks. There has to be. Something's missing. get some cover here we do have two archers oh god they've slaughtered so many down there I did not want to do that is there anybody up here wow many archers up here In 
Just took a step back just in case, because I think we want to coming up to that rock. The are a bit panicked now, though. They're going back to the normal positions. This guy. I'm trying to... I need to double check the controls here because I'm pretty sure when I when I checked this game on PS5 like mid last year when I like did like a one to two hours of gameplay, I'm pretty sure I could lock onto an enemy. I'm pretty sure. Get some arrows. He's this. Here he is again. All right. You know the name Ishikawa? I do. I have message. Speak. Sensei, all of Hiyoshi Springs will beg for mercy, like the victims of Hironori now. Silence! He was speaking. Hmm. Hironori Nagao. Didn't he die fighting bandits? It was decades ago. He was reputed to be a great archer. Did he study with you? No. Tomoe is spreading lies. But there's a seed of truth. She wants us to doubt each other. We are all that stands between Hiyoshi Springs and a bloodbath. Then we stand together. <clears throat> we'll plan the town's defense at my dojo. Meet me there and be ready to fight. Okay. So another tail down. More answers. I'm still curious about to, to mail. But I guess we can head back to the dojo. And I need to check if in the controls if there's any lock on, because I'm pretty sure there was. I could be highly mistaken, but I'm pretty sure we could lock onto enemies before. 
But let's head back to the journal. Uh, the journal, it's because I'm reading it. But if we look here now, uh, where is it? You. Sensei Ishikawa's traitorous former student to Mayo seems to be training Mongol archers in the thing. Meet Ishiwasha, uh, Ishikawa is dojo, uh, and half Daibo and minor defense charm also. And once we pick up that charm, obviously we can't fit it, so we'll have to be, you know, we'll have to head uh, to make sure we've got enough room on our charms and swap something out. Well, let's head back to the dojo and continue this tale.